In 2005 and 2006, I wrote up to almost 2,000 of the participants in the World Social Forum about endorsing a Unilets resolution. So, this is the text of my letter to those people from 2005. World Social Forum 2005 Unilets Resolution. Once again, John, the engineer Termel, can't attend the most highlighted anti-poverty forum this year. Once again, the Unilet's salvation of the planetary ship won't be won, probably, won't even be mentioned, probably. Sure, local currency advocates have stolen the show at past forums, but like the Toast conferences, they soon get shut off the agenda by bankers' agents. When was the last time anyone speaking at a plenary session had any good news to offer? A good new way to solve problems. Plenary speakers are picked to make sure no one does more than complain or beg. The anti-poverty establishment has proven to be, the, to the anti-poverty engineer, what the marijuana anti-prohibition establishment has proven to be to the abolitionist engineer. You would think the enemy of my enemy is my friend. I found the enemy of my enemy is my enemy's agent. Which is why the Let's Movement is loaded with moles working to break the systems down. Moles are morons who promote high accounting costs. Morons are moles who promote low velocity units. Moles who promote equal pay for unequal worth of work. Morons and moles who want central control over what anyone trades. Moles and morons who oppose every real improvement to make sure their lets always remain feeble economic toys. Jo jokes. Except that now Unilets has become the accepted name of the worldwide lets based on the time standard of money. Search for Unilets at any online encyclopedia and everybody knows what Unilets now is. It's just a time-based worldwide Let's. Just like Let's was shut off the Toes agenda from my first presentation in 1997 in Denver to the 1998 Birmingham Toes, the other economic summit just beside the G8, where I had to force my way onto the agenda to make a presentation on Let's that co-speaker David Boyle then backed out of. Then in 1999, when the German organizers in Cologne shut out any talk of local currencies completely off the agenda, and I had to force my way into getting a hall to make a presentation on Let's, at the Unilets, Worldwide Let's. Once again, the only presentation on the interest-free currency solution among the many speeches on the problem. I have no doubt that without me, the Toes 2000 must have successfully shut out interest-free currencies completely, so it was all about the problems and nothing on the solution. Which explains why Toes is now a spent force. The Toes moles have kicked all the real doers out until a cast of non-doers just couldn't hold it all together. Toes is now nothing but Trent Schroyer's social club. Then up pops Heloisa Primavera at the World Social Forum a few years ago talking about interest-free currency revolution in Argentina. They just can't keep success out of breaking into the news, though they're good at keeping it out after. I know other Letzers who go to these social fora, none with my talent for forcing currency reform onto the main agenda, but they are still there, explaining the local solution, tilling the soil for the year when the forum passes a resolution adopting the time standard of money and setting up Unilets until the UN is ready to take over the world solution. Funded with time credits created by the WSF World Social Forum, Maybe call it WSLEF, WSF Let's, for now, until Unilets takes over. Better to run Unilets for ourselves until a better offer comes along. Last year, I called every email of every speaker at the 2004 forum, 1,200 participants, and sent them three posts while publishing a list of all contacted about Unilets at the WSF 2004. And now, if the World Social Forum can drop all their resolutions condemning all the bad things and just adopt one resolution promoting the one necessary good thing, Maybe it can make the UN deliver Unilets as promised. Or the next Time Dollar Congress. Or the next whatever. 
So, my second letter to the WSF participants. Social, World Social Forum Unilex Resolution to all emailies attending the World Social Forum 2003. So I'm known as John, the anti-poverty engineer, and made the banking systems engineering presentation on restructuring the global financial architecture with a Unilex interest-free alternative time-based currency to the Millennium Forum on May 22, 2000. The time standard of money in a worldwide Unilex United Nations international local employment trading system was ratified in section c6 to governments of the millennium declaration at last year's world social forum 2003 the one optimistic note on the agenda was heloise's primavera's presentation on the use of local and provincial interest free currencies in argentina to end the crisis in the federal banking system forcing ford and monsanto to accept farmers receipts for grain and thus bypassing the middlemen national banks is the greatest victory to date in establishing the worth of community currencies so interest-free social currencies are now reported in 55 nations and thousands of communities around the world and it's time for the world social forum to do more to engineer its fulfillment than applauding miss primavera's impressive achievements past resolutions denouncing the world's many evils have had no effect when only the symptoms of the malaise are addressed the let's anti-poverty interest-free software addresses the cause I request that the World Social Forum promulgate but one singular resolution this year. No resolutions condemning the world's many evils. Only one resolution recommending the world's most needed good. The time standard of money with a Unilex, United Nations, international and local employment trading system, time-based currency banking system for all. I call on any advocates of the Let's anti-poverty social currencies who will be at the World Forum to make Unilets their one big goal this year. I call on all anti-poverty advocates to endorse the Unilets Resolution C6 to governments and the Millennium Declaration. And my third article to the Unilets was... The World Forum 2002 is come and gone, no major impact, so the Unilets resolution was received by the following speakers and contact people, I sent it to 1,200 people, remember, and I'll be looking at the contributions of each over the next year to, so that Unilets will be a major topic next time around. Well, the 2005 World Social Forum is rolling around, and I just want to make sure that the Letzers attending the forum try to make a bigger splash at the worldwide forum for the worldwide model. I'm in, I've included this reminder to the 1200 forum attendees, hoping they may have checked into the Unilet's worldwide solution to poverty since they heard about it last year. My next report will include the New York Times report on the Argentinian miracle that defies IMF prescriptions in my next post. Sure, there'll be lots of lectures at the forum, but what good are the L is for local crowd with their local suggestions at a world forum? Letzers have to promote the worldwide model armed with their local experiences. The money revolution can't be stopped. It can only be less speedily installed. So I talked about the Termel video that just came out. If you want to get it from the Chomor Brothers, called TermelMovie.com. And if any Letzers are going to the World Social Forum and favor a UN worldwide time-based Let's, I invite you to bring a copy of the tape along, which could help you shake up the forum. So the forum is the homepage for the World Social Forum. Notice that there's no way to contact any other participants. It's all kept secret, so no one can contact anyone else with going through without going through Central. So I detailed how the 50 years is enough moderators suddenly cut the communications among all the participants in the A16 demo in 1999 in the first 10 posts at yahoo groups dot dot com slash group slash A16 hyphen accommodations slash messages they started out listing all participants and after I grabbed the list and starting sending them info on let's they suddenly took down the list and erased everybody's emails so inter-participant communications were no longer possible the 50 years is enough group so, the fact the World Social Forum was also designed to impede inter-participant communications has to be noted. Note how the Rockefeller Brothers are the official sponsors. So, regardless, I got my list from last year, and I bet many of them are going back. And I'll be sending them out this year, too, in 2009. To those on the list, you, re you received the information on the Unilet solution one year ago. What did you do with that information? Look into the solution? Not look into the solution? Avoid the solution? Posterity will note the 1,200 participants from last year who heard of Unilets and didn't do anything about it. 
Once again, I urge the 2005 World Social Forum to not only endorse the resolution to Government C6 of the Millennium Declaration, but to agree that the World Social Forum should organize and operate the world unilets until the UN takes over from us. I don't know if I'd be, want to be a letzer and have it known for posterity that I went to the forum and did nothing to further the worldwide installation of the local system I love so much.